It's like rain. Stephanie, help. What were we doing? No, they don't know about that conversation. No, but they know about that song. Yeah, but... <laughs> Sleepy. They shouldn't know oh, Alanis Morissette. Cool, look at that tree. No, it looks good. It grew in. Yeah, I, I, I don't feel like I never saw that yet. It's like it grown in. Because I think we made that last time. Uh, I think we just... Yeah, we had just gotten there. The orchard. This you got a pretty big boat if you're growing trees on it. <laughs> Well, I mean, we also built, like, lofts and houses, and, like, we're getting cruise boat level here with this stuff. I was on a cruise boat once that had an ice rink on it. But, like, I mean, like, a big ice rink. That and, and a mall, too. It had a, its own mall. It had a freaking, like, Dippin' Dots. I just, har I just harvested the uh, apples by leaning against the tree for a second, and then they just politely surrendered them to me, I guess. Oh, what a world. In a world where this bullshit happens. I forget, did, didn't we get a third sheep? We did, but he's like wandering around somewhere. We have to keep yeah. an eye on him. We're also going to eat all of our stuff. Or we just got to keep, you know, keep him fed. There's Phil, gotta Phyllis. Got to him coffee. What did, I name, what did I name the other one? I don't know. His name is Garbanzo Giel now. <laughs> Guillermo. Guillermo del Toro. Let's see here. Oh, I'm keep them happy or they'll destroy everything you love. What were we doing last time? Oops. Does, does it have to show up the, the whole screen? That seems unnecessary. Does that have to cut off what Stephanie's doing? Yes. Improve Alice's quarters with a wardrobe. Too bad. <laughs> Travel to Susan's museum. We, we, we Five do views of Mount Furugawa. Fried chicken. We just oh, got, talk to a toll. We just got the man whore. The man he, whore. He's here now. That I gave Tim Curry voice, or tried to. Hello, little, nice little hedgehog that I love. I'm gonna give a hug to. Do you know what I my still, mouse needs? I still don't know how to hug her. That was very nice, thank you. Yeah, you know we saw it already. Did we? Yeah, we did. I, I gave you a shot. There's the roamer. A desk. <laughs> and some tools. Yeah, that's it. I know we don't have a lot of space on this boat. I don't know, dude. This is kind of becoming a dream scenario of mine. My bed next to my tools. It would be like I'm living a fantasy. Uh, it's o as somebody who lives that, it's overrated. <laughs> I could work on my own projects. Maybe build something for my daughter Ashley. Oh. Well, what's the use, right? It's not like I'm ever going to see her again. Oh. And she'll die eventually. <laughs> <laughs> I should stop daydreaming about it. I'm just trapped here. You know what's not funny? I can't even remember her face. Whoa. So let's just get that desk and I'll figure out what to make later. Way to, br <laughs> way to, way to br brush off that seriousness. Yeah, he's like, don't let the existential dread set in. Don't let it. Dude, like, I do. That does make me immensely sad when I think about people who like whose faces I don't remember anymore. Oh, yeah. That just happens. I mean, whether or not they're like actually dead or if there's people you haven't seen in a long time. But you're just like, you know, I don't remember what their voice sounds like. Reach out to people while you can. Yeah. We need aluminum to make the desk. And ash planks and a bottled ectoplasm. It's a lot of stuff. I think we can't make aluminum yet, right? Uh, we haven't gotten... We haven't... We haven't gotten aluminum in its raw form. A wardrobe. We can actually afford that. There you go. Framed photographs. Look at this graph! <laughs> if we, need, we want to make the commemorative dish collection, we're gonna need some aluminum also. Gross. So we're, 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 two, we're two out of three on, um, on upgrading our hedgehog's house immediately, actually. Like, that, that, that actually quick. was. We, I think we just were fortunate in our timing. Uh, or we were a little late on getting well, her, well, it's like, but, but already a, getting all the stuff. Already with, had all the stuff we needed. With, like, a toll, we were, like, super late on all of his stuff. With her, we were, like, super early. I think you just, like, you just happen to run into things, you know? Yeah. Hello, so, snaky snake. I am neglecting my duties. She doesn't want to hug me. She's afraid if she hugs me, she'll want to eat me. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, oh. Feed her faster. Vroom. It'll be like some, like, um... Some, like, Twilight stuff. Where, like, she gets too close to me. And she, like, wants to have like a friendship with me but she can't because she's too tempted to eat me all the time my god Ooh, 
I would have liked Twilight Nord more Vila. if it was about snakes. <laughs> you would have liked Twilight more if it was the stars. <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I think there's like the temptation at some point, but it's not very well established. What in uh, in which one? In Twilight. Yeah, no, they, they don't linger on it for long enough. Supposedly, I've... that's like the reason why, like the meet cute moment where they see each other for the first time in the movie looks like he's sick, is because he's supposed to be so <laughs> yeah. Like turned on by her blood and revolted by the fact that he wants to eat her, basically. Man, and that's if... why he makes. <laughs> so, like, given those confusing instructions, the director was like, "Just make like a face, and that's what you got in the movie." Dude, I'd be so upset if some person made a face I'd like that at me. It yeah. would hurt my feelings immensely. I see you picked a spot on the map. What a wonderful initiative, Bambina! Seeing the world, going places, meeting new faces. It's also exhilarating. Before we go somewhere incredible, though, could you do something for me? Let's go somewhere else. Okay, I'll let you in on a little secret. I want to make someone really happy. Shh, don't say it out loud. A secret, I told you. And yes, you guessed it right, a very special lady. I want to show her how much she matters to me. Ha! I knew you would be on board this boat. <laughs> All right, we need to go to the bottom line core to do some shopping. I've heard some. I've heard the shop there just received a new batch of fancy chocolate boxes. And she just loves chocolate. She doesn't love fancy. I don't believe him at all. No. I don't believe him oh, at no. all. She doesn't like fancy stuff. The dark, the dark and expensive kind. It's the perfect gift, don't you think? Wonderful, Bambina. Let's head there then. I, I looked. There was no choice to actually respond to him because he's not actually going to listen to me. No. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He doesn't get her. No, he doesn't pay attention. So he either doesn't pay attention or he's like fucking lying through his teeth in his first mother chick yeah. or some st shit like that. I hate him so much. <laughs> You're spoiling me, Stella. What an incredible piece of furniture. It livens the room so much. Yes, much cozier now. And filled to the brim with clothes and accessories, too. You don't know how happy that makes me. But what are you waiting for? Jump out of these old, dirty clothes. Pick something with some jazz to it. Jazz. Because she bought this stuff for us, because she's yeah. the nicest Clothing character so jazz. far. Oh, well, fine. I'm just oh. vanilla. That's all I get. Okay, I, I can't- oh, I can't change your color. Oh. I can set you to no. <laughs> <laughs> it just don't exist anymore. Uh, I think you get to pick the color. Right? Oh, this is the entire outfit at once. So oh. I need to make the parts one by one. So I can have like an arctic blouse and a red hat. Mustard trousers, huh? Got some interesting picks here, hedgehog lady. <laughs> all- just to have denim. <laughs> just be dull <all> denim. <laughs> My little my little baby cousin wanted to wear a denim jacket, and me and my aunt had to explain to him like why he has to not wear the same color denim pants and jacket, and how that's like a rule with denim, denim jackets. You can't wear the same color. I feel like this costume right here that we're looking at here was like ripped straight from uh, like A Link to the Past. Like when you start getting like alternate armor and tunics as Link, he starts becoming a weird amalgamation of colors. And you're like, look at me. Look at me. Oops. It undid all of it, didn't it? Yes. <laughs> all I did was try to page backwards, you fool! Yeah, do, yeah, do X. Purple shoes. There I am. <laughs> Look at me. Interesting choice. <laughs> <laughs> well, that certainly is a, a modern choice. Very youthful. What about something more uh, classic? I think there was a nice periwinkle outfit in the bottom drawer. Try it on. Oh, so she actually like new outfit. Whoa! Purple as fuck. Yeah. Do it. Fantastic! Oh, sweetie, isn't that so much better? Look at my face! Is she an overbearing- I don't like she it. She might be an overbearing, uh, mom, grandma You should wear person. entirely one color. That's- that- it matches! <laughs> you look so adorable, I could just eat you up. And there's plenty more for you to try on. Don't be shy, come over anytime. I always love do doing these little fashion shows with my granddaughter. Oh, what is it? You found an envelope on the bottom of the drawer? How peculiar. Well, don't make me wait. Open it. What is it you say? Pictures and letters? Oh, those are mine. How did they ever end up there? What a mystery. Look, this is my husband's handwriting. 
Oh, it's messy all right. He never was a delicate man, but quite handy and so very loving. Oh, well, would you look at that? My backyard. See all these trees? Sweet Eugene planted a tree for every one of our children. And then for our grandchildren. We grew apples, cherries, pears. I remember my granddaughter playing in her mother's apple tree. Such sweet memories. Oh, look at me rambling again. Go ahead, sweetheart. I won't hold you back any longer. It's funny that the, the wardrobe was full of other costumes, but she specifically placed... She clearly placed one of them in there for us to choose, assuming we'd pick that one. It's like, oh, wow, I dressed yourself up. I, oh, not like no, I, that, uh, Maybe that, uh, that one. <laughs> you can be pink. Oh, oh, do it, do it, do it. You can be pink, and I can fix myself. I, 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 you know, I've said this before, and I don't mean to be a hater, but dude, I hate that freaking outfit so much. It reminds me of the of the pirate shirt from Seinfeld. Which outfit? Yours. The entire one. Just the style. No, the style of it. Like the I style hate or the, the color. Well, both. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't mind purple. It's, I don't know. I just I hate the I hate the shirt. I got the pink the shoes like Gwen had in Spider Man. I'm a pink cat. Oh wait, now. no, she Fuck had you. no, she was mo no, she had green shoes. Damn it. That was a, that was like one of those neat details that she had these uh it, it clashed with the color of the rest of her costume but she had these like these like teal dancer shoes that that like cuz the rest in, of her in which one, which iteration um, of Spider-Man are you talking about? Uh there's like a million spider -verse. So. Okay. The one she was Spider-Gwen. Oh yeah, she I, has, like the white like and the hood and like the red highlights and stuff I think, but then like her she had these uh teal dancing shoes on. When uh when that movie came out, I just shaved the side of my head, so everyone like and I had the same like the, the, I had like the blonde hair, and it was like the same length, so everyone out of the woodwork was like Stephanie, na 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 na, they stole your haircut. I'm like shut the fuck up. I haven't given it much thought before now, but Stella, this orchard it looks almost exactly like the one my husband built. Have you seen all these fine details? Yes, he was quite the woodworker, at least until his hands gave up on him. Oh. We planted our first apple tree along with the birth of our first daughter. You should plant a tree for yourself. Of course, it'll take some time before it can bear fruit. But once grown, it'll make you feel so proud. It accompanies you your whole life. Oh, listen to me rambling again. I'll get out of your things now. Yeah, she just really wants... I th oh, so I think she would have said that before, but we didn't, if you didn't have an orchard, she wouldn't have progressed it. Maybe. So now we have an orchard, she has a specific request She for has so many things to react to now. Yeah. No talking, only pain. I think we, Learn. I think we did get her kind of late because I think we just had all of her stuff already. Yeah. Thank you, Munchkin. How did you turn an apple into that? <laughs> That's incredible. <laughs> A magician. Not even sure how that happened. Oh, see now she's like, incredible. This tree, Stella, it grew so quickly. Yes, we're hella far. <laughs> I'm sure the love you gave it helped it tremendously. The laws of this world would allow it. Well, I'm glad the tree is fully grown now. I know you'll be able to build some great memories here. Stella, I've been doing some thinking. All my life, I had to take care of others. Cooking, cleaning, taking care of the children. They're a blessing, really, but I've never had any time for... Excitement. Adventure. I thought, if it's not too much of a hassle, of course, and since we're traveling all over, all of the time, well, maybe you could come on a little trip with me. Just you and me. It'll be fun, I promise. How about that little hamlet? Nordweiler, was it? Is that where I just am right now? I don't remember. <laughs> it's where we are right now, and we're about to get out. <laughs> From what I've heard, it sounds just like my Swedish romance novels. Ones with Fabio on them. Oh, how I can devour these. What, you're also a fan? I knew you were a woman of culture. <laughs> anyway, if we're ever around these parts, I think we could have loads of fun. Don't those lights look distressingly noose-like? <laughs> <laughs> he just jumped- Whoa! Whoa! You, you can jump up on the shelf. Oh, we both can. Oh, were you- Oh, you were already outside, that's why. Yeah, that, I guess- that, tri <laughs> that tripped me out. I was like, what just happened? The, the tree was taking me. It decided that that was a yes. Cut, cut, cut. I'm sorry, it's, <laughs> you know, it, it's snowing. I probably really shouldn't have done this at this time. Probably should let the sheep have its wool for another day. I mean, eventually day. they won't even be able to see the poor guys. You gotta help them out. You gotta help some zouts. I mean, I, I get the impression that uh, they lived, you know, many, many, many hundreds of years, thousands of years before people Oop. ever intervened with them. And so I, I don't think that it, uh, 
I think they found a solution for that in the past, although well, I don't know I, what it would have been. I think we bred them to, to be, be extra like that, woolly. and that's why it's a problem. Yeah. Uh, well, we just fucked I don't everything think it, up. I don't think they were that bad originally. Oh, Stella, thank you so much for bringing me here. I mean, just think about what real bananas look like versus the bananas that we created out of them, and imagine that for sheep. Well, think, <laughs> uh, or think of cow. Like, can you yeah. imagine like a cow is stalking and as big as it is now, being like agile enough to really function super well, just walking around the world, you know? Yeah. But yeah, we just we ruin everything. Oh, smell the crisp winter air and these colors. Why, I feel like a young girl again. Oh, let's go already. I can't wait to see all the sights. She's freaking so cute. Good day, sir. The autumn end. A, a score to a song that's perfect for when the leaves are falling. I'm sure that'll come up. That sounds pleasant. I can't afford it. I know. This one of the... Uh, Chicky. Don't we need a... Oh, we need, we need chicken for fried chicken because Atoll yeah. is a, such a needy... We need a chicky. Bastard. He's our best friend. He's our uncle. Wow, pears are expensive. Pears are one of the things we still don't have yet, right? Yeah. How much are pears? 1640. Oh, cool. Yeah. Oh, it's for an orchard, right? Because the trees last a long time, I think. But, you know, I was thinking about that when I planted the apples. I was like, well, I was like, fuck. I planted both <laughs> like things as apples. I probably we, should have not just, done that. We can probably just murder an apple tree. Right, can they're, you? They're, yeah, they're easy to kill. They can't even run. <laughs> they are easy to kill. <laughs> Your apple is easy to kill. Wait, do we need flour, too? Uh, Yeah, I think it might have been flour and... Chicken. And chicky... Bullion boy eyes. I'll never learn how to word, read it, pronounce it. Somebody was nice enough in the comments to say what it was, and I forgot already. So I'm I'd sorry. Also, to that I also individual. already forgot. Yeah. I forget you read the comments sometimes. I, I do sometimes. Look how much money you get if you just throw away the stuff we made. A lot of y'all are very nice. <laughs> Got the autumn's end, which seemed important. I once again can't afford pears. <laughs> 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 not it's 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 cute, but it's not as good as certain other characters. From, what the, from certain other games? What are you talking about? This it better laughs. Oh, well, oh, you. Oh, I wonder which character you're talking about, <laughs> Keith. <laughs> <laughs> Explode! Oh, oh, I want another sheep. Oh, hey, a new one. <laughs> But wow, I, we're gonna be overwhelmed with sheep. Well, the, the I, each each little pin for them is so fucking. Uh, it takes so much resources that yeah, I'm like it's so irresponsible. So that, well, but, that I want it. No, they'll feed themselves though. That it'll just be a, a problem in a different way. I want it. I don't think I know you. I think my partner wouldn't like it if I were talking to a strange child. Don't talk to me again, please. I, I think usually, or if you do, do it discreetly. I think it's the other way, where it's like. I wish I could find find my keys. <laughs> usually, people don't want the child talking to the strange. Yeah. Usually, it's not like. I don't think an, I mean, I an adult would get mad at another in. adult for talking to a child, like who was who prompted it. I guess <laughs> I don't know. What a command. You should always move your arms when it's cold outside, like this. Look, I'm talking and moving. I'm multitasking like a champ. Wow, what a god. No Come one on, can stop me. I'm gonna climb your house now, bye-bye. Did you get mad at your partner for talking to a child? Because I, what if I was asking you for help? I'm just saying. <laughs> it's do I! Oh, maybe this is the place where we get this power. Look at all these zip lines. Look oh, at all these yeah. zippy lines. That sounds like an important thing. There's so many zippy lines. Where am I? There I am. <laughs> Uh, oh, is that an ancient wooden elevator cage? Where the f- is this whole thing? What a wonderful construction. I didn't think I'd ever see one with my own eyes. Remember? It's by climbing one of these that Ansgar managed to get away from Harold's gang. A treacherous and icy cage that claimed many a young daredevil's life. But of course, Ansgar managed to escape with the Countess Sapphires and with ease and grace. Oh, the novel. Yeah. Yes, he was quite the cat burglar. Oh, look at me. I'm swooning just thinking about it. As for us, I think we should just climb the ladder. Watch out for ice patches. <laughs> Dude, I used to read... And she fell to her death. Romance novels for adults. Uh, Is the sheep gonna jump up here? I hope so. <laughs> it's a big jump. And I remember the one about the guy with <gasps> the... Oh, oh, we need this. One, oh, we have one out of two. Zipline! Oh, it is the zipline skill. We should have an... 
But we we've gotten enough people. Why we do we need one more of the zoopy doops? Do we need to the zaba de bab Bring doops. another human. The zanga bang booms. Or not a human. Bring another character uh, with us. The mark of a passage paid in full. An obol. Well, that's not what it's asking for, right? It's asking for a. It's, yeah, it's an obol. Oh wait. It's got oh. little. It's got the little star on it. That's what they give us. Isn't that so, what they give us when? I'm pretty sure they give us an opal when they first Yeah, so, so we're not taking their payment up front? What the fuck, people? No, I think we do take the payment up front. Do we but, use it? Uh, yeah, I think we bought a different skill, maybe, like gliding. No, but we should have enough for another one. That, that gliding thing was a long time ago. We keep, yeah, we, but we just got, like, freaking... It wasn't that long ago. It was, like, last session, I we think. We got Scar. Because our, our first one... The math probably checks out. The first one was double jump. That costs two. The gliding costs two again, I think. So, so that, that, so, if we have one left over, that means we have five. And I think we probably only have five characters so far. No, but we we just got Scar. Yeah, but he's a freeloader prick. Oh, okay. Oh, they got, I guess that. He part actually might. Out. He might just be part of her storyline, and they might just share, and they might even leave at the same time. I don't know. Oh, uh, they. Uh, I guess we'll find out. Yeah, that's irritating. Is this a new song that I can play when I play songs? Well, I guess he isn't asking us for a house. So yeah, I guess. This is what Gwen gave us, right? Yeah. It's some uh, important personal item. Yeah, because they probably all give us a memento when they leave. That might that just be for us. Yeah. That also might be the only hint of how she died. Because I don't think we got much. Well, she was constantly smoking on yeah. her ship. <laughs> like, nonstop. Oh, and this statue here with the bushes ever white. Just as I pictured it. How uncanny. Doesn't it remind you of the shrine where Ansgar offered the sapphires to Agneta? I would have stolen a hundred gemstones and fought a thousand ruffians for the opportunity to gaze upon your beauty before a second. Oh, how romantic! And then she confessed her love, and then they died. No. <laughs> well, you know what happened next. <laughs> Although in my mind, it wasn't so cold outside. You just KO'd back there. <laughs> I'm like overwhelmed by the sexiness <laughs> of that story. Well, Ansgar sure was hot-blooded. I know that's how he makes me feel. Tee -hee. Oh, the cute old lady re reading go, the fucking raunchy books. Down? Huh? Her mood went down, I think. Is He's hungry. hungry. <laughs> I was like, why is she seemed happy with that conversation? Why she makes frowny faces? There, back to happy. Look how happy they are. I feel like it's like having like a toddler with you, where you have to like check every once in a while. Like, do you need a snack? Mm -hmm. Are you? Gonna do, you need a, do you need a snack? You make a poopy? Are, are oh you, fuck! <laughs> like you're freaking oh, out there's, on there's me. No 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 no! Don't do that. There's a thing. Oh, it'll be fine. You fool! You lost a second. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh. Okay. Just, right, we lost it's her. Take a little platforming to do this. Fuck. Hey, you got it. I, I think the cat cheats. <laughs> <laughs> I think the cat has, just, has an easier time I'm just platforming. Good. You always seem to somehow be higher than me when you glide. I, mean, I, have, I have a smaller shape, so maybe it's easier to visualize. Yeah. Oh, in this dark, windy spot. Just like the scaffoldings where Ansgar and Harold dueled. Oh, I can see the scene so clearly. The clicking of the swords. I don't think that's the sound that swords make. <laughs> the distant barking of dogs and the whistling of the policemen. Even the smoke reminds me of the train station below. And then glinting in the shadows, a small needle-like knife. And just as Ansgar was as adeptly disarmed his opponent, the treacherous Agneta emerges and stabs Ang Ang Ansgar in the back. Of course, how could Ansgar know that she was the half-niece of the cruel Herald? The bleeding Ansgar advances haphazardly to the edge of the scaffolding. And as he reaches the edge, he glances back and finds that he is cornered by his opponents. With nowhere to go, they know it is but a matter of time before they can del deliver him to Duke Frederick, Ansgar's long estranged twin brother and usurper of the family title. But Ansgar, elegant to his last breath, raises a hand in farewell, smiles softly and, just as he is engulfed by the smoke from the locomotive below, she's acting it out but you're in the way. Yeah, I'm in the way. <laughs> Ouch! Oh, what? 
Oh, Stella, no, I'm all right, thank you. I'm good, I'm good. She hurt herself reenacting it. She, like, fell? Just, I I'm a little tired. Let's get back home, okay? Just, let's go. Oh. Oh. I'm sorry your life was not as exciting as that. And she hurt herself she trying hurt to herself be exciting. She hurt herself because it reminds you that you're, you're getting older. Any items hidden around here? No, my favorite romance novel is the one where the guy has cystic fibrosis, but he's also a race car driver. He, <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't even die of cystic fibrosis, even though it's a main plot point. He dies in a, in a <laughs> race car accident. His name was Mark Gianni. Me and my <laughs> friend cried about that forever. <laughs> Oof, wait up. I'm... Uh, I'm tired. Would you... Would you mind helping an old lady walk back to the tender? Oh. Good day, sir. That's, 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 a, that's, a, that's, that's a sheep. A sheep that's <laughs> <laughs> walking very strangely now. Oh, he's stuck. He's uh, trying to keep up with. He's trying to match me, but I'm moving slowly. Good day, sir. Oh. Getting this poor old lady. Yeah, getting old must be heartbreaking. Nope. Did a little running. Let's get you home. Yeah. That's enough excitement for today. <laughs> Down the rabbit hole. And then, I, and then I always think about, like, people who want to, like, they want agency, but they get old and their family tells them that they can't do things anymore. Oh, yeah. Like in the movie Chocolat with Johnny Depp, where the old lady wants to eat chocolate, but she has diabetes. No. And, like, it, but it's, like, the one thing she likes. And she's, like, too stubborn to not. Yeah. That's, a, that's, that's one of those good movies. It's not uh, amazing, but it's very charming. Where do I want to go? I could just go in a straight line here and then just deal with stuff along the way. Or, sh we, or should I be well, try to be efficient and use the bus stops? Was that question mark where uh, where freaking Scar wanted us to go? Something at least. Do, do we need... Yeah, no, no, get down. I can't get down. I can't get down. No. Buddy, Overboard. no, no, stop, stop. <laughs> Damn it. Are you like really? It oh my yeah, it doesn't gosh. work here. I don't think that sucks. That's annoying. That is annoying. It's funny how like I'm pink now, but we're in like a like our, this area is so white that it's like very hard to tell that I'm actually a different color. Yeah. But it's not like a big emergency, but whenever he passes by it, like I want to check to see if our tchotchkes, if we have tchotchkes to sell, because who knows how much money we might be sitting on, unbeknownst to ourselves and others. There's a lot. Why well, we haven't cleaned up for a while? We well, we got all grody. I mean, at least that's the that's the plus side to us missing the our old onion friend. Oh wait, here. Let me. Are you mad at me, Peanut? Have I done something to offend there. you? No. Good. Feed me then. Pretty please, Bambina. I'm starving. Dude, he's gonna want fancy food or some shit. Like, I, he's gonna be some... We don't know any of his... Yeah. I mean, he clearly <sighs> likes fancy stuff because of the whole... Thinking that other people... Because he, 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 he projects that onto other people. Fine dining shrimp cocktail. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> now this is something special. Quite the fine dining experience, Bambina. I, Giovanni Leon Formidable, am... Cre a creature of refined taste, of exquisite complexity. And this, this hits the spot. It's spaghetti. Oh my god, look at it. It looks so good. <laughs> look how good the spaghetti looks. <laughs> That's a really confusing eating animation. Yeah, he, doesn't even, he doesn't even twist his fork. He just stabs it. As, oh, I guess there's a meatball. I guess that's what he's doing. Yeah, but what a, that's a very, it's a very showy way of eating. Well, he is very showy. Yeah. In, in this lighting, you can see he's like these little purple blue flowers that like weren't as clear to us when we first got him. Yeah. And he's so much like darker looking than I like had in, originally understood. Cause we got, we got him yeah. at like sunset. Yeah, he's like a dark purple. This hits the spot. Delicious. Grazie mille to the chief. Yes, I know <laughs> it's, it's you. chef. Oh, chef. I keep mixing <laughs> them up lately. I like um, how we. I like how we disaster. know we're at the sea lion because of the music. Oh, there's a hug. Ah, but I fell. Stuff. Wow, we're really tall now. You sure know how to hug it out. 
Fine dining is not his favorite, but it's up there. Well, it's just not his favorite actual food. I'm sure there's something in the category of fine dining that's like his actual favorite. Yeah. Like the exact one. I wanted to have a word with you. We had some fun together with the trip and all. But I can't keep following you around like that. It's just too tiring. And besides, it's not befitting of an old lady like me. Just... Has anybody told you how smothering you can be? Whoa. Oh my gosh, what the, what the fuck? Whoa. <laughs> Please, leave me some space now, will you? That actually really hurt my feelings. Wow. You're the one that gave us the purple outfit and then... Well, she, she wanted to dress us and she, now we're smothering. She's, no, she's projecting because I bet you people talk no, to her she, Yeah, no, like she, has, that. she has issues to work through. And she's taking them out on us just like everyone always does. Well, I mean, that's kind of, it's almost kind of our job, to be honest. Yeah. Take no, that's that just what, that's also just what old people do. <laughs> clap, 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 clap. Thank you for being a friend. <laughs> <laughs> Oops, sorry. Gotta set our new destination. Cause we just sit in here. I'm gonna see if I can make fried chicken. Oh yeah. That is worth a consideration. I think it's... Oh, it's fat, damn it. Because it, uh, the flour was for the lobster... The yeah. lobster sandwich. We, we need to find damn fat. It. That's what it was. Okay, I was like, I, I like, was questioning We did a it. good job finding fat-free plants. <laughs> or, I mean, fat-free chicken. You need to eat so you don't eat my uh, crops. Thank you. Yep. You are fine. I like how this one's gray now. Just gonna lean on this tree for a second. So that's Garbanzo, and this is Sir Wellington. <laughs> like, look at this! Look at this animation. I just go. Hmm. Apples. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, tree. You just stroke the tree and you uh, thank it for its contribution, and then it just brrr, apple at you. Yeah, you know, being a farmer must be so easy. Yeah, I don't like, know why they complain all the time. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, giant weird fool. Sorry, I'm like so far away. <laughs> I'm just happy it lets us out. Damn it. I screwed up in mining and I have to wait for 10 years to try again. That drives me crazy. Hello, I just waved at this tree. Look at me go. Hi. Oh, because we're going to cut down. Okay. Oops. I like I like Why these am turtles. Why I so bad at this? The gossip turtle. Fuck! I always feel like I'm not actually waiting that long, and then it does that. There we go. Hi. Hi. I need your help with the tree. <laughs> uh, there we go. Okay. Oh, yeah, you're yeah. waving at me. Yeah. It's, I realized that it's like, oh, I'm waving because we're gonna cut it down, and it's a co-op action, not because. I, I I get the apples from this tree by being nice to it. <laughs> hey tree, can I get your consent to like just yeah. chop you the fuck down? Copper and iron, oak and maple. I'll do an oak here, I guess. Why not? You want more oak or maple? Eh. Limestone. There you go. There we go. Stella. Stella. <laughs> You know what would be nice? Something to eat, you dumb bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I like not starving, you fucking lunatic. I might start cooking if you're always going to give me the same things. Oh, right, I gave them half the last time. I'm sorry, there's many people. Here's some very boring food. No, you should have. Uh, there is uh, no hassle with plain food. No fuss, no muss. Are you all done there? All right. I'll see you later then. Goodbye. She's she's so cute. I always expect more dialogue than we get. <laughs> Why well, I'm always there just in case. Yeah, I I'm, re I'm ready to voice. I always think we're gonna talk, but then they just say, "Bye." Bye. We uh, we probably could start doing stuff with the wool, but I don't think we have anything to use the wool for. We just have all these sheep with like no no purpose. Because you, you can like. Because I don't think we have uh, anything that requires wool yet. Like we don't have like a. It's not a need for us. Maybe. There's too many things for me to keep track of at this point, so I just go. You just go and then you just see what you have I when you get there. Hope for the best. Yeah. 
I just see requirements and I'm like, oh, I do or don't have that. Our little snake friend's making the plants grow that I just planted. Thank you. More wood to process. She's busy, but I want to see if she needs a hug. There's no way to do this one faster. No, come back, Snakey. Yay, her chakras are aligned now. I can give her a hug. Her her voice is my favorite. Her little nya, 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 nya. Uh, the you you're being summoned by uh. Well, they're gonna have to wait for six Lynx logs. lady. Because I you know because I can't do that. Both wait. They don't let me. They discriminate against me. Because I'm a peon. Yeah. Hey, it's told no. It's told you want a bed. That little like. All those little rocks aren't enough for you. Stop beating on windows, you weirdo. I like to think that like she she says like can I talk to you and you're just over here like cutting logs and she doesn't have like the she huh doesn't, she doesn't even think to like even take one step towards you she makes you yeah. make the whole trip over to her. You might have noticed, but Alice, well, she seems to have some trouble getting around, doesn't she? I don't think she can use ladders anymore. And you put her house at the top. Oh no, I'm not sure she'd tell you, but I think she's stuck up there. Maybe you could move her house down to deck level. I'm sure that would help her. I'm Aww. sure that's Astrid, uh, you're so that nice. That actually is nice. I take back me assuming it was gonna be some bitchy request. No, Astrid looks out for other people. That's I... like the first thing we learned about her. So easily you forget. Well, no, it's just like, it just, it seems, it comes off as so conflicting because of how she talks to people. That, that, that's, that's like the thing that's like the funniest about her character. She talks to people like she's kind of a bitch, but she actually does have like good intentions. It's funny how complicated people can be, and it's like really yep. important to like always have that in mind when like to not write people off as have be like being so simple. Imagine others complexly. Well, that's too hard. To steal from Vlog Brothers for the five thousandth time. There we go. They're just the best YouTubers on the planet, and they'll never not be. And there's two of them. Wow. And they're actually brothers. Yep. Their mothers, uh, um, their their mothers, their, <laughs> their mothers. mom must be very proud. Mm -hmm. They're both New York Times bestselling authors. Oh, I forgot that we were here for a thing. Yeah, it's uh, whoever was writing poetry at that one point, I think, or well, they sent like an SOS out, and then we went to their family, and they were like, "Whatever, a dumb bastard." This is a this is a sister, right? I don't remember. No, no, no. Well, I don't remember because this person was like, "Oh, give this letter to my sister." Maybe. I don't- yeah, I have no idea what their voice was or who it was. Well, I'll, it'll just be Stephanie. Would you look at that? We were able to find- you were able to find my sister in the village? That's incredible. Is she mad? Don't tell me. If I make it, I'm sure that it will be worth something at least. Thanks again. I'd probably be at the bottom of the ocean without your or my sister's help. You haven't, we uh, haven't oh, done anything yet. No, because the other yeah, sister was like, here's the instructions, tell him not get fucking lost this time. That's what it was. Yeah. Because he can't get on the boat. He doesn't want to get on the boat. Like, you know, it's very noticeable that none of our guests get on the boat because getting on the boat has implications. Yes. You can't just get on this boat unless you're a sheep. <laughs> they don't have a concept for death. They just. Yeah. Sheep are just sheep. Sheep are interstitial beings. Confirmed. They walk between the the twilights. Sheep can see dead people. I don't know if you heard me dumbly shouting like, wake up sheeple at my computer earlier or not, but it was because I was watching a video where a sheepdog was trying to herd the sheep and one sheep was just like staring them down and like facing off against them and was like not having it. And it's like, no, no, order has, order has been destroyed. The, she the sheeple are awaking. That sounds like a wonderful video. <laughs> I always think about my dog because she's a she's a border collie, like trying to command the respect of sheep, and I just can't <laughs> picture it. <laughs> oh, hello, it's you. Have you seen Eugene? Oh no, she. Oh no, she has, she has dementia. dementia. 
He must be in the garage again. That's the mood swings because she gets confused. And it makes her frustrated. Yeah. Because she knows, like, she knows that there's something wrong, but she can't figure it out, so she just lashes That's out it. at people. Yeah. When you see him, can you ask him to bring me my old wooly? It's getting a bit chilly in here. Oh. Uh, too, uh, oh no! My old legs won't carry me anymore. Can you perhaps help me get to the prowl? There's a prowl. Do, 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 Little do, one. Do, do. Gosh, that I sucks. Hope that it's the back of the boat. I don't think it. I think it was her no. house. Maybe it's just her house. What's the prowl? Quick, Stephanie, look it up on your phone, or we'll never. She'll never survive. She's gonna die. I'm gonna wear her out running back and forth a lot. But I don't walk it. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! You're just making her walk further? That's the worst thing you can do. I'm looking at it up right now. Hurry, phone, hurry. Prow. Prow. Oh no, I went the wrong way. What the fuck is the, is the front of the boat? The prow? Oh, I the, thought it was wait. something else. Oh, a bow of the ship. That's just the front, isn't it? The portion of a ship's bow Why above water. The, why'd they call it the prow? Why don't you just call it a bow? It's already called a bow. You're just adding a letter. Yeah. The for the most forward part of a ship. Why was she walking left then when she asked me? I, I don't know. Carry her. Well, no, I, no, our ship does go that way, Keith. It does go. It, it goes. It goes. It doesn't go right, doesn't it? it yeah, it goes. Uh, it goes to the right of the screen. What? So that's the front of the boat. Yeah. Okay. I, no, thought, yeah. I, I, thought, I thought you were saying that wasn't the front. Oh, well, no, I wasn't at the front. I was at the back. Okay. No, I know which side of the ship's the front. Yeah. Little one, some people are getting a bit hungry. Have you thought about the next meal? Some people. She's secretly she's means herself. She's bacon and vagaries. Here's some paella. She, no, she doesn't like exotic, right? Oh, she doesn't like... Yeah, she's so she likes plain. boring. And she likes desserts. She really likes she's desserts. such a boring little granny. Or old, what about old fashioned? That was on there. Old fashioned. Go up one. Shellfish. Oh, this is absolutely delicious. There is nothing more reassuring than a good old fashioned dish like this one. I think that was what we needed. Yep, she is I such a it. type. Thank you very much. What is she eating? Oh, it looks like a, like a seed. I don't know. Yeah. It's like ham taro level. That little lick she does. Seed. That little lick she does. Yum 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 mm, yum yum. yum. Old-fashioned dessert are her likes, but her favorite? She was slighted by Giovanni's flirting. <laughs> Did Giovanni try to flirt with her? <laughs> she is an old lady. I mean, a lot of them are. Yeah, I guess so. She just seems she just seems the oldest, but I'm not sure. I think maybe just because she has dementia. But she's come. I would just assume that by in age, in actual age, she was older than everyone else here. But I don't know. Yeah. Like Gwen definitely came off as being young. Sorry, my phone just dropped. And, um, Aster definitely comes off as being old, but I don't get the impression she's, like, immensely old. Giovanni, I'm assuming, is about her age. And then, uh, our little snake friend doesn't seem particularly I old. She seems just, like, middle Aww. age. I baked some food for everyone, but it might be overdone. I'm sorry. Apple Aww, pie! Keith loves that! I can only give one person the apple pie, though. For everyone, she said, but that doesn't... Yeah, that's not how consumables work in this game, so... Bleh. Like... <laughs> The fucking like music that's I in his mind. I got planks. <laughs> I like that he he wa he walks like Simba does uh, during the Akuna Matata song. I the, do they they totally I yeah, swear that they just like that little head shake. It's so specific. Doom, ba doom. And he somehow has his mane tied up like a scarf around his neck. No, he's definitely just scar. He's a lot to take in. Nope, you need to be. He's shorn. happy scar. And I need to pick a new goal again. I'm neglecting our duty. Well, I mean, we, we got distracted by a d distressing revelation. Yeah. Spoilers, every story is sad, and they're dead. <laughs> and the the thing, like, dementia is particularly scary because you die from it. Yeah. It's not as if, like, I mean, old old folks, like, the, the kind of, like, loss of cognitive function is, like, fairly natural to some extent. But, like, dementia is, like, severe, and you do die from that. Any kind of like disease that affects your ability to be yourself and affects your memories, that's just like a devastating one. Yeah. It's 
a barrier is being broken. Where where do I go? Because <laughs> uh, you can't go past there. Let's just cut through here. Oh. I think there are like a series of diseases Oops. that are all like have to do yeah. with like the the myelinated sheaths of your neurons, and they're like all terrible. Everyone that has to do with your neurons is like the, <laughs> they're always the really bad ones to get. Yeah. ALS is like one of those. MS is one of those. I, I think I think dementia. It's like a lot of old, a lot of people's like ultimate fears. It's just the worst thought. And they're, they're ones that we just are actively working. There's just no known cure for it. We can't figure it out yet. If I remember correctly, that was the plot of uh, Judgment, one of the Yakuza spinoffs, was that it's about it was about a uh, a potential cure for dementia. Speed the what if it happens if I give the sheep coffee beans? Well, it's just out. the beans. <laughs> yeah. Just loses its goddamn mind. Just dies on the spot. No, like, uh, like, Lou Gehrig, Lou Gehrig's disease, that's, like, the most famous instance of that. I don't know if Parkinson's has anything to do with that, but, no, it's just, mm. And people had, a uh, had hopes for stem cell research, but that got blocked for a really long time, and so it kind of put us back, I think. Yeah. Because people were very afraid of it. Another Dark Ages. I mean, people, I almost think people still, I think there is still very weird restrictions on it. People get really, yeah, people usually are constantly freaking out about that stuff. There's, there's similar stuff going on with the coronavirus uh, vaccines. Oh, because like, it's, it's, uh, it's RNA? It's always the go-to thing. It's like, it's made of babies, you monsters. And then, yeah. Yeah. That's the loop. There was that whole South Park episode, which, like, the whole joke being that they actually eat fetuses for stem cell research, and the whole point yeah, of it being like, that- they, they crack the neck and just drink it out of the neck. They're just showing how absolutely ridiculous, like, the thought process of that being the reality of this is, by, like, pointing out just how absurd. That's kind of, like, their method for tackling a lot of topics. I remember the similar note of, like, the, uh... The AIDS episode, or like, we found the cure, all you have to do is inject yourself with ten million dollars cash. Yeah, because they had like, Magic Johnson on the, there. Based on the idea, like, the reason that Ma Magic Johnson's done so well for so long is because he's just so wealthy and covered in money all the time that he, that he just doesn't progress and get any worse with his disease. I think they're having a flirting moment over here. Look at them, look at them. He's saying, he's hey, Bam... His, he's oh. looking at his nails that way. He said Bambina, but I think he's talking to you. Yeah, I'm Bambina. You know you're special, don't you? Oh, yes, you do. And if you don't, shame on you. Just look at you running around taking care of them, taking care of me. I hope they're all grateful to you. Point me to one of them who's not, and I will have a little discussion with them. But no, really, Peanut, you've got to be proud of yourself and what you're doing here. You're killing it. Heavens, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> that is kind of funny. We should go get those chocolates and see how she doesn't like them. You're killing it. Yeah. That was at the, uh, the corp. The evil heartless corporation place. Yeah, hey, I wasn't- I don't know if I knew where it was. I recently devised, like, I was just like, oh, let's just cut through this big area that's not explored yet. That's what I was positioning myself for for now. I think it is over in that direction. Anyway. It's uh, not a, I'm not easy to remember places sometimes. I got planks. <laughs> <laughs> it's so <laughs> planks, wobbly. get your planks. I made some planks for you, Stella. Enjoy. One, <laughs> one plank. I How dare you? <laughs> one plank. At least she made one pie. Some of us work. <laughs> and one pie makes sense because, like that, like all the work goes into making a pie. People usually only make one pie at a time. People don't usually only make one plank. It seems harder to, see. to like not cut the wood around the plank to make the plank. You might as well just make the rest of that wood planks, yep. sir. Ba -doop, ba -doop, the toll is ridiculous. Yep. Completely ass silly. My favorite part about this mini game is the waiting. <laughs> How was your day, Stephanie? Alright, I'm in the middle of it. 
That's nice. I'm a good listener. <laughs> <laughs> you are actually a pretty good listener, Keith. Until I zone the fuck out, well, and I, then I just politely pretend I didn't. <laughs> you know, I mean, I think everyone is prone to that. Yeah. But, but Oops, it, that was a mistake. Yeah. I got what the gents. fuck you doing? Well, now we're done, though. But you know, okay, there's like people in your life, and you have to think, okay, like if I, if I, I, I need to talk about something. Who's gonna listen to me talk about it? And you like you run through <laughs> the people in your brain. Like who's gonna listen to me talk about it and a not provide solutions or talk over me about it or tell me I'm handling it wrong, or b uh, who will actually just let me talk about it and not do the oh I'm sorry moving on I'll talk about myself thing the waiting for your turn to talk thing. Yeah. I don't know if we can remove a tree. I think we just have to wait for it to die. Sorry, I fucked it up. Maybe we just need more orchards? More orchards. Huh. You know, dear. Peanut, would you have a snack or something? Ah. Uh, he likes fine dining. Let's try exotic next. Eesh. Sorry, Bambina. That thing is chock full of carbs. Oh, healthy, maybe? I can't do carbs, honey. Hey, call me vain all you want. I gotta take good care of this body. You're dead. How could my <laughs> hair sparkle and my guts resist gravity otherwise? My guts resist gravity? I can't eat stuff like this. It would go straight to my butt. And you don't want that, do we? I don't know. I think some people would like that. Just saying. What did I try to give him? Exotic. So don't give him exotic. I, uh... You get, there's there's like healthy on there somewhere or there was I don't know if we have any right now but it's try healthy. Real veggie. Ha! Thank you, Bambina. I was hungry like a lion. Ha ha ha. Thank ha. you for this food. Mm. But that's carbs. And th that is the most carbs. <laughs> that's so much carbs. Spaghetti is like not what you want to like eat if lion. you're avoiding carbs. That was a good one. I'm hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> He narrates to himself whenever he says Astrid a joke. is so smart. Why is she with this chump? You wouldn't happen to have a little something to eat, would you? We're just neglecting everyone. There's just so many people in such a big place now that it starts to be a little worrying that they can't take care of themselves. You're really, yeah. Regular is good. Thank you, Munchkin. We don't ever talk to her, though. We don't know her favorite Chips, food or one of her... Look how chubby she looks in her picture. We're missing a whole like and a dislike. Yeah, it's because she's, she's head on. And she's really furry. Yeah, all the hair makes them look like they have just giant fucking heads. And also, they have giant fucking heads. Well, because they're cartoon characters. Yep. And that's just how that goes. I haven't fished Is in a million night, years, night? or cooked in a million years. It's not night night there's, yet. There's so many things so to we do. Must, we must have arrived. We were in oh, tuna. There's tuna. Or, uh... Whatever that weird was that weird oh that's a it's a bridge area. Right? Where we get a power. That little symbol that looks like the Libra symbol, but it's not. Um what are you talking about? The one in the middle of the big circle right there that's vibrating that's the on gate. us. Yeah, that's yeah. Oh the gate gate. This okay. is the gate. Ooh, ooh, that the one. Ever okay. Door. okay, don't go there. <laughs> that's the place where, that's the sad screen. I thought I thought <laughs> it was the one where we get power ups. But I forgot that they hide those from us. <laughs> They'll make it Little clear where to find those. You know, our power is the Kalstein Mines. The... It definitely our, wasn't our, past our, there. Our power is at Nordvale there. Is yeah. where the shrine is that we that we want for our zip lining. Now I'm looking for bottom line. Yeah, no, I... I yeah, I know it's not past the blue line. Because we didn't get there yet. Is bottom line where we found Astrid? Yeah. Where the fuck is it? You know, it's kind of a shame you can't, like, look it up y like using a sh search bar or something. It probably would really be helpful. What? Yeah. Where else is there? Is it- is- oh, and that, that one says new on it, but we, have, we don't have the thing to get to that yet. South Point Docks. Yeah, we should never have been there yet. Where did we find Astrid? Yeah, it was- it was called Bottom Line. Corp or something, right? It was it was called that, and because because when he gave us the place, when he said like, he gave us the place to go, he called it that. And I don't think he would call it that if it wasn't like the actual name of the location on the map, you know? Because it was all in, it was an orange and everything. 
Shopping, really? He's definitely more romantic than I could have imagined. Yeah, right, she doesn't want that it's either for himself or someone else, or he just knows her so little that she's gonna get mad at him. What did Alice mean by old wooly? A blanket, maybe? Made of fabric? I should find out and give it to her. Yeah, because she asked for Eugene to bring her her old wooly. Hmm. Um, we could, um, we have a bunch of wool, so we could probably make a blanket. I just don't know how that is done. We need to walk her home in the evening. Oh, man. Poor lady. Oh, yeah, sorry. I was, I was, I was, I was thinking about how sad I am. <laughs> <laughs> the sea air is so nice. Once my daughter, Annie, and I had a little outing to the seaside. It was such a nice day. Oh, there was a picture of that day in the envelope you found the other day. I've got it right here. Look at her outfit. Oh, it's so fashionable. It's all purple. <laughs> <laughs> Later that day, she lost her hat to a gust of wind, though. Well, what a shame. Oh, are you ready to walk me home? Oh, we and got a beach, beach outfit. outfit. We can dress up like her daughter and then really fuck up her dementia. <laughs> Dude, honestly, that might actually happen. Mm -hmm. And I'm not saying that we should do that on purpose, but I'm curious to see what line of dialogue that'll open if we do that. It might be what's expected. Yeah. Maybe it'll spark memories for a moment. Like in, um... In, in, in Coco. Oh, the man. Most emotionally Talk devastating about things scene. that make you cry. Remember me. Dude... Anytime there's like, ah oh man, this, this makes me think of a, um, fucking, what's that movie that everyone, every, it's like the romance movie that every girl likes. Notebook? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> In the notebook, there's the part where the old man, or the old woman remembers him for like a minute, and then he, then she instantly forgets, and the old man cries, and me just thinking about an old man crying just makes me immensely <laughs> sad. The movie only makes me cry during that scene because I have to watch an old man cry on film. And it is <laughs> devastating. But yeah, it's like she like... Yeah. Ter Freaking don't watch that movie. You don't want to be immensely sad. Mm -hmm. I noticed that some fruit in the orchard were ready. I picked them for you. Here Aww. you go. Oh, thanks, sweetheart. She gave us apple. I don't know when she did that. <laughs> uh, yeah, she can't climb up the ladder. I'm a little confused by how and when she did that. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Anyway, time to devastate her. She asked the sheep to get it for her. Chess Garbanzo, the This is sheep. way better than the plum one. It's still just the same freaking pants and shirt, though. Yeah. I know. Yeah, it's, it's just it's just palette swaps, because otherwise they'd have, to, they'd have to reanimate it, which would be a nightmare, oh, because yeah, she's so yeah, animated. Yeah, yeah I, know, so, I understand. So it's, gonna be, it's just going to be recolors, because they can palette swap much more easily than reanimating the character with new clothes. I actually do like that one. <laughs> it's probably why we couldn't go to sleep, is because we were neglecting our duties. It like wouldn't let you go to <laughs> you leave her out all night. <laughs> Gosh, that'd be terrible. Stop. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> Is someone gonna get me out of the bath? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Male. I could have drowned it. Oh god. <laughs> Stop reminding me of Edith Finch. Oh, uh, I was thinking Gilbert Grape. Oh god. I could have could have drowned it, Gilbert. I have no I concept of how fast time is going. Madison here, y'all. We yeah. are fixing it up this week at Feeder. We are mixing it up this week at Feederama. We got a perfect meal for lovers. We've got we. <laughs> All right. We provide you with milk and rice for rice pudding, bitch. Have we been cooking anything lately? No, because we've had so much food. We we There's we've so had much so stuff much. Happening. Yeah. I keep watering plants and harvesting them, but we make nothing out of them. Someone's calling you. Well, they can fucking wait. I'm making rice pudding. Just don't- if we ever get fat, just don't use it for whatever thing they, they send it to you for, because we need it for fried chicken. <sighs> oh no. My old things won't carry me anymore. Could you perhaps get me to the prow? Gosh, she's up early. Yep. The, lo the older you Oops. get, the less you have to sleep. Yeah. I mean, uh, your metabolism is slower, so you're not like you're not burning as much. You, like you don't have to. And also, you're not growing or anything. A lot of yeah. like kids will sleep for a long time because their bodies are working really hard. And you're less active. Yeah. It's like the exact opposite of the ever of the infinite dream. <laughs> it's the infinite wake. <laughs> Gosh, now I just don't want to get old. 
Well, I don't really have any solutions for you there. Damn it. Why yeah. haven't they invented one by now? I know, so someone should get on that. Why haven't you? Ah, oh, you forgot. That's what you're supposed to do before breakfast today. But figure out how to stop aging. <laughs> yeah. I knew I was reading something. <laughs> Hopefully it's not early onset dementia. Oh no.